Hey, good afternoon. It's uh, Alan Smith again bringing you another great uh, episode of the Southwest Florida Daily Tour of Homes and Foreclosures. And of course, I'm your host. I try to bring you this daily blog tour of real estate information on homes at least a couple times a week. The last two days were simply great. Uh, I had a lot of people for the open house this weekend I wanted to do these tours for. Uh, and the last two days were tours of all the homes on Fort Myers Beach, walking distance to the beach, under 500,000. I believe there was 22 of them. Today's tour are going to be pool homes on Fort Myers Beach. And of course the price will go up somewhat, but to get a good tour of pool homes on Fort Myers Beach, I had to go up to 700,000. So today you're gonna see about 13 pool homes on Fort Myers Beach, still walking distance to the beach and the price range will be up to 700,000. Tomorrow, we're gonna see a tour of 25 Cape Coral pool homes that are waterfront golf access and they're all the entry level price range from 350 on below now those aren't going to be homes that are you know most of these homes are going to be a 30 to 40 minute boat ride out to the river and then of course it's another 30 minutes to get down to the golf and open water but it does put you on waterfront golf access salt water with some lovely homes most of them are older you know florida style homes some of them have had updating remodeling but you stay tuned wait till you see this tour of homes up to 350 and then after that I'll probably do up to 500 in Cape Coral so anyway uh, if these homes aren't exactly what you're looking for give us a call at 239-872-7736 we're the leading buyer specialist on Fort Myers Beach Sanibel and in Cape Coral we specialize with working on buyers it takes us no longer than two to three days once you're in town to find um, you the perfect home I don't know when the last time was that we spent more than two or three days working with a buyer only because our exclusive proprietary search systems do such a thorough job on mixing and matching, sifting and sorting through all the homes, the foreclosures, the short sales, um, the bank owned properties, the for sale by owners to find our clients the perfect properties before we ever uh, get in the car and start taking a look. So we can get it nailed down to the top five, six, seven, ten homes uh, so that the first day you're out looking at homes, you're looking at homes that match perfectly what you're looking for uh, and then you can just decide from there. So give us a call, let's get you set up in our system and start working with you one on one if you're looking for or a home in Southwest Florida. Let's start working on today's tour today. This first home, uh, again, is going to be at the top of the price uh, frame, and then we're going to work on the way down. This home here is a three-bedroom, two-bath home. I do have a professional video tour of this home as well. If you'd like to see it, just shoot me a text or phone or call and you know something and let me know, and I'll be more than happy to get it out to you. This home is over in Tropical Shore Way. Uh, nice home. It's being sold, fully furnished. It's about 2,100 square foot. It's a canal front home. It has uh, over 2,000 square foot under air, about 3,600 square foot total living space with a private pool and spa. The home also features direct golf access and is in a weekly rental zone. For the, those of you who don't know or haven't been watching my shows, some of the homes down here, uh, most of the homes on Fort Myers Beach and Sanibel can only be rented 12 times a year, minimum one month, which means that if somebody's only there for a week, you have to let it sit vacant the other three weeks. There are a few weekly rental zones on Fort Myers Beach. This doesn't include condos. Condos can be rented weekly, but homes cannot. But there are a few weekly rental zones. This home is in one of them, as is that Best Buy I showed you earlier in the week that we held open all week. This home here, $6.99. Now, number two home is uh, on Denora Boulevard. This was a home built in 77. Again, I have a professional video tour of this home that I'd be more than happy to send to you. It's a complete modern res renovation with direct golf access and a ground on the ground floor. So no stairs in this one. So if you're looking for a home, you don't mind the older ones because you don't want the stairway. Everything new has to be built up on stilts, so you're going to have stairways. 
This one was built in 77, so that's not the case. But this one would definitely be on your must list uh, of, of homes that you must see. Starting from the top, it's got a new roof, new impact windows, new stucco, new trim and doors, new open kitchen with stainless steel appliances, wine cooler, new pool with cage and pavers. This is a great mid-island location on Denora uh, at a price that is uh, $469 a square foot, which is definitely a premium price, uh, but it is all new. Uh, older vintage, very nice lot, mature landscaping, six ninety four nine. Now keep in mind, folks, I put all these tours without the video in PDF photo form underneath the home searches tab on the Facebook page. And what's great about that is everybody can view them. You don't need to have a Facebook account to view our Facebook page. Just click around the little box that Facebook throws up at you. I want you to sign up if you don't already have an account. This home is on Astero Boulevard, so it's right on the main thoroughfare um, in the 8300 block. This is a three-bedroom, two-bath home, older, built in 73, but as you can see, it's been updated and, and could be just what you're looking for. It's on a canal on one side and a sandy beach on the other. It's a gorgeous three-bedroom waterfront home. It's on one of the closest canals to the open Gulf waters. It's an easy care for property with the Xeriscape landscaping. It's got tile floors and the granite. The home is also set back a good distance off of Estero Boulevard so that at least you have a little bit of privacy. This home is a great vacation rental property that's rented consistently with high rental income in 2015. Of Listen to this. 2015 income for this home was 46908 and it allows one week rentals on this one. So a great opportunity here for you. 665000 Okay, now this is a home over in Laguna Shores area off of Australia Drive. This home here is $650,000. It's also waterfront with that great covered dock you see there. It's located in the southernmost tip of Fort Myers Beach and it's completely remodeled. It's waterfront, golf access, pool home on an extra large lot. It has lots of upgrades throughout this home as you can see by the pictures. It's got the, the, the standard granite and stainless and front loader washer and dryer and privacy fenced in yard and pavers and everything. But it steps to the sugary white sand and minutes to shopping dining dining and entertainment. So it's definitely a home that you want to see. It is on the higher end at $478 a square foot at $650,000 asking price. But as you can see, a lot of space here. Great, um, you know, Florida living at its finest with a wonderful view of some of these canals. Okay, this waterfront home is 644, so it's a little less, still has the big wraparound dock, got dual boat lifts, so you can rent one of these out for about 300 a month, or your buddies, of course, will all be down there and want your boat, put their boat on there, or you could just have maybe a flats boat and an ocean boat, or who knows. This home is off of Albatross, in the area of Faribault Isles, it's a two plus den, two bath home, about 1600 square foot with gorgeous interior finishes. It is canal front. Uh, has a pool with a pool screen and high impact windows, metal roof, and nice wood floors. The den could be converted into a third bedroom on this one. So if you need the third bedroom uh, versus the den space, uh, this one could be converted or you could just do the typical high to bed kind of a situation. A lot of clients do that. Now it's got a spacious kitchen in it which has a chef's Bosch five burner cooktop which I noticed that I know a lot of people would like. And one of the cool things about this location is you can walk to Santini Plaza where you can request, you know, you can shop in all the shops there and the restaurants. Boaters, quit golf access out to dozens of restaurants and marinas nearby and you're going to be out fishing for redfish, tarp and snook or maybe uh, doing some snorkeling with the manatees and dolphins in no time. But 644000 get you a waterfront house, golf on the beach, uh, or close to the beach, on the bay anyway, with that home there. Now this home here is right again on Astero Boulevard at $605,000 as we're coming down in price. This one's a little larger at about 1,900 square foot under air, 2,800 square foot total. Now this one is called Southern Exposure. It's located directly across the street from the white sandy beaches of the Gulf of Mexico. It is on the busy Astero Boulevard, so you know, you give and you take. But the price doesn't reflect how close it is to the beach at $605,000. It is completely renovated. It is in a weekly rental property. Uh, it can accommodate two to eight people. The upstairs is light and bright and airy. The home um, is two bedrooms and one bath. And downstairs is another legal 1-1 and a magnificent private pool, as you see there. 
So uh, you can rent one, stay in the other, rent them both. Lots of opportunities and things that you can do with this particular home. Now this home here is over on Denora Boulevard. This is a two bedroom, three bath built in 90 and I have a professional video tour of this one. The price of this one is $599. It's an immaculately maintained and updated home. It has a split bedroom floor plan, with two master suites and a half bath. And the home's got a very private backyard and a swimming pool area. Astero Bay is only a short boat trip away. It does have a 7,500 pound lift. It's got a large sunny back deck, which I thought would be superb for entertaining. There's also a large comfortable shaded area under the home uh, with a tiki bar. Uh, it does have deeded beach access, which is just down the block and it's being offered partially furnished at $599. Again, I have all the pictures of that home listed underneath the home searches tab on the uh, Facebook page. This home is on Sunnyview Boulevard. It's a three bedroom, two bath, built in 73, um, 548,900. Uh, it is a pool uh, home. It has got a two car garage here. It is in Fairview Isles, if you're familiar with that is. So here, if you're a boater, you're gonna enjoy quick golf access uh, with a go-to dozens of restaurants around. It is an older home built in 73. It is being sold unfurnished at 548,000. Now, rounding out today's tour is this one. We've got five more to go here, but this one's 519. It's also in Fairview Isles. Now you can kind of see the overview of where this is at, give you a little idea. Uh, it's a bay inlet canal home. It's got a spacious floor plan, large tile floor throughout. It's located three properties from the bay on a unique canal with complete privacy across the waterway. You have boat and jet ski docks, both seawalls, got 100 feet on the water at 519,000. Go check out the rest of the pictures of this home. I got about 20 more photos of this home if you're interested again underneath the home search tab. Now this home is a 74 vintage home for 495 over on Redfish Road. 1600 square foot, about 2400 square foot total. So if you've always wanted to live on island time, here's a chance. It's a gorgeous remodeled pool home. It's just a short walk to the sand. And at 495, it's under that, you know, that 500,000 number. Uh, for one of the best kept secrets out on the island. Again, I got 10 more pictures of this one. I want to get to three more houses today to show you as we're coming down in price. This one's over on Poor Old Street. It's a four bedroom, three bath home built in 50, sold turnkey, which means everything you see, linens, towels, everything goes with this one. Has had a, also had a huge price reduction down to 495. So it's ready for seasonal hideaway or for a great rental and or personal use take a look at some of these photos uh, for your paradise dream home at 495 and we're getting to the last two homes the least expensive pool homes on the island this one's 429 it's over on Baja Villa in the Santini crossing area two bedroom one bath built in 61 a lot of house for the value here weekly rentals are a uh, allowed and the seller has a permit to rent it by the week so it's rare to find in a family neighborhood very cute canal front cottage lots of nice things this home made it between 30 and 40 thousand in rental a year so you can factor that into your costs at that four hundred and twenty nine thousand dollar figure again I got another 15 photos on the Facebook page now this one here is Jefferson Street uh, this is a mid-island location, two bedroom, two bath, built in 65, about a thousand square foot beach cottage, but it's 2,300 square foot total. If you step outside your door of this beach bungalow, you're going to have your toes in the sand within minutes. It's updated home. It had new windows put in it in 2016, and it's the second least expensive pool home on the island at 369. Actually, that's not true. That is the least expensive pool home on the island at 369,000 and there's a picture of the pool. Well there wraps it up folks. A, a tour of all the homes on Fort Myers Beach walking distance to the beach that have pools already in it. That's about 13 homes. I'd love to help you out. If those aren't the homes you're looking for let's chat. Get you down into your searches that find you exactly what it is that you're looking for and we can help you all we can. We're buyer specialists, the number one brokerage down here in Southwest Florida. We got 700 agents, got a lot of things we can help you with. There's not a question I can't answer about anything that has to do with Sanibel, Fort Myers, Fort Myers Beach, Cape Coral Real Estate. So give me a call, 239-872-7000.
7736. I'm Alan Smith wishing you a wonderful, sunny, 82-degree Florida day wherever you may be. Bye-bye now.